Hey guys, it's me Liam. For 2017, I'll be making videos to share my food and cooking adventures with you. It's February, and people are still trying to keep their New Year's resolutions, like adding more vegetables to their diet. A great way to do that is with soup. Follow along with me, and we'll make a delicious, healthy beet soup. For this recipe, we'll need one cup of cauliflower. About half a head. We'll also need two cups of beets. About three medium beets. One cup's worth of red potatoes, so about two potatoes. You'll also need balsamic vinegar. You'll also need chicken broth. You could make it yourself, but that's a whole other video. So now I have all my ingredients, and I'm going to go over the list one more time just to make sure you didn't miss anything. Beets, cauliflower, garlic, yellow onion, red potatoes. First, we're gonna clean the green and the stem from the cauliflower. Peel and dice one cup's worth of potatoes. So first, we're gonna wash our beets. As you might know, beets are one of my favorite ingredients, but they do stink. So when using beets, you're going to want to wear rubber gloves and use a plastic cutting board because it's easier to clean. So now I'm going to add two tablespoons of olive oil, half teaspoon pepper, and half teaspoon salt. We're going to mix that into the bowl with our beets, potatoes, and cauliflower. Now that they're all coated, we're going to put them on our prepared baking sheet lined with tin foil. You're going to roast these for 35 to 45 minutes in your preheated oven. Vegetables are almost done roasting. We're going to add about a tablespoon of oil to our pot. Once that's heated, we'll add the onions and the garlic. Some oil is ready. Now I'm going to add my onions and cook till they turn translucent. My onions are ready. Now I'm going to add my garlic until I can smell it. Once your onions and garlic are ready, add one quart of chicken stock. the roasted vegetables. Bring the mixture to a boil. Once it's boiled, cover and reduce for about 15 minutes. Now that the soup is cooled, I'm going to add one tablespoon of balsamic vinegar. Give it a stir. So now we're going to blend it up. Now that your soup has been blended up, we're ready to eat. Some great toppings for your soup are sour cream, microgreens, salt and pepper. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy the video. For full recipe details, check out my website, thelittlelocavore.ca. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on social media at littlelocavore.